first of all, before we get into this video, I gotta say, bro, y'all are some goats, okay? Y'all are some goats. Dog, I've been going off YouTube for two months, right? I came back, what, like a week ago? And we already at 93.6. I, I mean, my guy. My guy. Y'all are seriously some goats. I appreciate every last one of y'all. But anyways, um, this video right here has been traveling across the entire social media platform literally all right so i had to go ahead and check it out for myself the full video not just the clip that they were showing i had to check out the full video of course it's dealing with um drag queens you know our our favorite people on the earth you know what i'm saying these, these people are the best people the greatest people of all time you know what i'm saying these people are wonderful I love the fact that they go to schools and they, you know what I'm saying, dance in front of kids. Like, I love it, bro. They're so amazing. Without further ado, I'm going to go ahead and get into the video. Let's get it. Let's go. We're actually going to bring out a few more people to add to your team. Who is it? <gasps> oh, <laughs> we brought two seemingly different groups of people into our studio to see if they could unite in a one-of-a-kind dance challenge. Favorite dance move? Oh, oh. For the uh, electric glide. That's what you a, know about the electric slide, hey, man? That's only oh. in the hood, man. About uh, electric uh, glide, yes. Wow, that looks exciting. That's you, pretty good. All right. Yeah. Shift. I like a little cute little strut, strut, oh. strut, and hold. And look, and look, and look. The funky chicken is what got me over with the girls. Go like, boom. Don't, don't, don't ask me what this wheel. And I'll do my spinning around. And, uh, and and do my little leg action. I like to point. Okay. Oh, oh where's she going? She's there. Where's she, she, she going? Where's she going? Right in okay, bro. We is what one minute in the video. What am I watching right now? I'm watching old people dance. Look, I feel like, bro. What has my life come to? I have nothing better else to do in my life but watch old people dance. I am watching another person, grandpa, get jiggy with no women around. Literally no women because the they not women. Those are men, okay? I'm watching all grown men. I, I got three grown men dressed up as a woman who think that they are women or I don't know what I don't know what they think they are. They, they're delusional. And then I have three grown old men, grandpas, getting jiggy. I feel like my life has come to an end. I literally, that's crazy. Um, this is what I'm watching. Make combinations of the twists, then we get the shimmy going with both. I like their freestyle with a little bit of hip hop. I love Beyonce. Love Beyonce. Yes. I, I like the Beyonce. I love J Lo. Oh, you love. Yeah. I'm a Britney girl. Mm. Oh. That pop girl. You know what you're doing here today? No clue. <laughs> oh, I have no idea. What are you? we doing here? Today you'll be choreographing a 60 second dance routine to a song that I'll be giving you. Okay. Whoa. We're the okay. choreographer, huh? Bring it on. You'll only have 30 minutes to choreograph and practice before your final performance. Oh, okay. Oh, girl, just cut we, it down to 15. We oh, got this. We got this. Honey, whatever you like, we do for you, okay? <laughs> <laughs> no, she didn't! Question? You said our team. Is this the team, or is there additional members of this team? We're actually going to bring out a few more people to add to your team. So <laughs> okay. Yeah, see? Who is it? <gasps> oh! Oh, Hi. Oh, Hi. Hi, Phil. Hi. Hello. What's up? What's up? What's up? Amber. Hello. Amber. How are you, Phil? Such a strong handshake. I was very turned off by it, but I wanted to use the wisdom of God to my approach, so I prayed about it. The Holy Spirit said, I want you to stand up and be strong. You know, I've never really worked with a drag queen. I see him on TV, I've seen him on a stage, but to be next to them, wow. Hey, no problem. I can work with that. I've worked with different types of people like that before. Does this work out? Three beauties and three old guys? Yeah, Perfect. Just my type. No, no. When the grandpas came out, it totally changed the whole situation. I was like, how are we going to do this? I don't know how they dance. It goes from, you know, I just want to do some maybe oh my, kicks and... Oh, she's scary. Oh, he's scary. Oh, Lord. Oh, gee. Oh, Jesus. Oh, oh. Jesus, save this country. Please, look. I know we's I, we called to love everybody, and I, I I ain't got 
less love for him, her, whatever. I ain't got less love, but I'm just saying, oh my gosh, this is, this should be illegal. I, it shouldn't be, this should be illegal. Seriously, seriously. I, am I saying anything wrong? This is a, this is the, this is it. Okay. And turns to a little step touch. This is going to be challenging. Your song that you're going to be dancing to today is Toxic by Britney Spears. Oh. Wow. Does everyone know that song? I don't know. Who's think... Britney? I don't. <laughs> I was surprised at some of the steps they were doing. I was like, Grandpa music. can move those old balls of his. What did you just say? I was surprised at some of the steps they were doing. I was like, Grandpa can move those old balls of his. Free. Hey. Right. Free Britney. Your 30 minutes begins in three, two, one. Okay, so ah! I, I, I like to be an A person out there on the, be, on the beginning because okay. you have to have a pose you in the routine. beginning. Okay. Have, right, so let's get the pose thing out of the way. Talk. Does anyone have choreographical experience? She does. You she do. does. Okay, well, I would like to listen to you. Yeah, let's just do it. So why don't we just pair up? I'm not into I'm touching, not, okay? I'm, I'm not into touching. Okay. Put that out front. I'm no touching, no touching. No touching. I won't touch you. I was paired up with Isaac. He was like, no touching. I was like, oh, this is going to be fun. No, I'm grabbing I'm grabbing the stud here. I walk into a room and they go, oh, old guy, conservative. And so they put you in a box. So I just do the best I can and hope, hopefully that it's good enough. So the music will start. The boys will turn around. So right. gentlemen, let's turn. Gorgeous. And then we start walking. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Three, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then maybe let's look at the gentleman. Gentlemen, you guys can acknowledge us. Ooh, who is this? Cool. Oh, I'm yes. sorry. I'm sorry. I can't do this. I can't do it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm a man of God. I can't do this. Oh, no. Yeah, I love those people. I pray for them. I would never do anything to hurt them or condemn them. But men are not supposed to dress like women. I'm not going to go along, go along with that. It's time to stand up and be a man of God. Hey, Amen. This, this is the type of people we need. Seriously. Seriously, this is the type of people we need in this world. Because they will, bro, they will sit there and say, oh, be who you are. This, no, bro. A man should not be dressing as a woman. I don't care. I don't care what you think, bro. That is the fact. Forget your feelings. Put your feelings aside. The true, the truth is that a man should never be dressing as a woman because guess what? That is not what God created us man to be. Okay, we are supposed to be protectors and providers. We are not supposed to be dating. We're not supposed to be with women. Not like that. Not like we're not supposed to be with women, but we're not supposed to be acting like a woman. Okay. I don't know if y'all peep, but in the generation that we're living in, it seems like more women are acting like men and more men are acting like women. It's getting backwards. It's seriously getting backwards. I respect this grandfather, this grandpa, whatever you want to call it. I, I have your way of saying old in a positive way or whatever. I respect this grandpa for speaking the truth. For speaking the truth. I mean, seriously, this man did nothing. He didn't say nothing wrong. He respected them. He said he's not into touching because you are a man. Don't touch me. Don't touch me anyway. Don't touch my back. Don't know. I don't want you think. I don't want you caressing my shoulder. I don't want you. I don't want you doing anything to me. Dressed as a woman, you're scaring me. Especially this person on this. I'm gonna say something else, but this person on the screen scared me very much. He brought up the religion, like I'm a man of God thing. I'm from the South, and I grew up with you know homophobia. Racism, like all that, you know, being non-binary, trans, black, all that. No one was being inappropriate towards him. So for him to act like that, it's kind of like, you're old, but you need to grow up. Oh, you can be with me. I take on. What do you, what do you mean by that? You are literal, you are a literal man dressed as a woman. It's not even about religion. You people are stupid, bro. It's not about religion. It's seriously not about religion. You are a man with a deep voice. And you have two sets of alls, and you have a pitness, you have all that, and, and you talking about, oh, he brought up religion, and this, and I dealt with this, and I dealt with that, I feel like it's time to grow up, bro, you need to grow up, you are a grown man dressed as a woman, you're childish, you're childish, all this lipstick and makeup you got on, you look like, you look like an actual 
I'm, I'm not even gonna say what I want to say because YouTube may block me. I'm not even gonna... on two anytime, pal. Should we go Move your ass figure out. Y'all fill in the blank. Y'all definitely fill in the blank for me, okay? Because I'm not gonna say it. But if y'all say it, I I didn't say it. What's wrong with him? I felt like a little bit uncomfortable, but it wasn't something that I'm not used to. Whether me because I'm Latin, or if it's because I'm, you know, a drag queen or gay. I've been doing this for years. I'm like. 37 years old and things happen you just brush it off nothing stops us we're moving yes, yes, forward yes. to hell with it so go okay so people. why don't okay so now we so, did that we come so up actually, here so, so you come up on one side you come up on the other side yeah. i was trying to just forget about him and move on he was no asset anyway what they say all the time the show must go on and that's what we did one two oh i three, see four five six seven eight is that okay? That's great. Okay. You're Listen, perfect. Right? Perfect in every way. I'm like, you're kind of jealous. Is that all right? But I'm old. I can say anything. Wait, I'm old. Nobody gives a shit. Have, uh, can we hear where we are in the music? I know myself. I kept looking at the time. I was like, okay. Uh, some people want to you know, move at a faster pace than others. We're going to actually start on the opposite side. So, Phil, you're going to start there. Oh, no. Oh, God. <laughs> you're fine. You're Wait fine. Are we getting carried away on this? Okay, I'm not going to watch the rest of this. Seriously, I, I, I'm be honest. I'm not gonna watch the rest of this. I, it's, when I is they is how the wigs is not giving what it's supposed to get. At least if you go dress like this, at least make sure yo 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 your appearance look at least somewhere decent. Y'all look a hot mess. Seriously, the wigs is oh lord. I don't think that was nothing wrong with what he did. If y'all feel like it was something wrong with what he did, I ain't talking about y'all, but I'm talking about the people that was in this video. Y'all are delusional. Seriously. Seriously. What, I mean, what is wrong with y'all? Y'all are grown men dressed up as a woman and you talking about forget about him and let's move on and let's do this. He was no this and that anyways. Bro, for you to be a man and you're accepting another man, this bro, imagine this is your son. Imagine this is your son next to you dressed as a woman you had a son not a daughter imagine your son dressing as a woman you supposed to raise man to be man a man supposed to raise another man to be a man not to be a woman this is why we need fathers in the households seriously we need some type of structure because this is sick this is truly sick old school he was he was just bro he kept it real he's old school he kept it real. He kept it what it should have been. It's not about religion. It's not about believing in God. It's not about none of that. I pray that you guys really seek after Jesus' heart and lose this desire of being a drag queen. I pray that y'all lose that desire. Once y'all seek after Jesus' heart and be filled with the Holy Spirit, yes, I pray that y'all truly do that. But however, if you another man and this is your son, like this. It's like, how would you react to this? You going to accept that? You going to accept that your son is dressed like this? Y'all need to stop giving it to what culture puts out there. Like, seriously. I get it. it, it sometimes it be, sometimes you want to follow what culture puts out there. Sometimes you just want to be accepted by the people. But our job here on earth is not to be accepted by people. I'm sorry. We supposed to be here on earth to make Jesus Christ happy. We're not here on earth to, to be accepted by others around us. Seriously, this is this is this is sick. This is truly sick. But y'all let me know what y'all think about this in the comment section below. Uh <laughs> when I seen the when I seen the clip on TikTok, I was like, bro, I have to react to the full video. I found the full video. I can't even finish the full video because it's gonna be them dancing with I just couldn't I won't be able to finish this whole video. I'll my face will look disgusted the entire time. Y'all let me know what y'all think about this in the comment section below. Before we get off the video, I got a big, big deal for y'all. It's not really a big, big deal, but it's a big deal. You feel me? Y'all see what I got on right now. This right here came from my boys at Fan Customs. All right, Fan Customs done hooked your boy up. They look, they told me, hey yo, Jay, the pen. Look, we got some stuff for you, bro. Get out to your fans. Woo, woo, woo. I said, back. Cool. You know what I'm saying? What it is, what it do. They said, hey, we going to give you a 10% discount code. So if y'all use code DTV, you get 10% off your order. They got they got little jackets like this. You feel me? Now, this right here you can't get, okay? But 
You know what I'm saying? You got these, you got jerseys, you got everything you need, anything fashion related, bro. They got it. So go ahead, go to fancustoms.com, use code DTV for 10% off your order. I love each, each and every one of y'all, man. Y'all pray for these people. Without further ado, it's me, your boy, Depan. God bless. Stay blessed. Peace.